Hi guys, have you ever been to the dentist? They've told you you've got receding gums and then there's nothing that you can do about it. It's not always the case. Check this out. So in today's case, I'm going to show you what we did for this lady to improve her smile. So if we go, if we did the, the kind of smile analysis, it's her front, teeth, front four teeth that she didn't like. She's been to a whole bunch of dentists. They've used um, what we call composite or bonding to try and improve the, the look of these teeth, but it's really not worked that well. So we went through all the options and we decided on porcelain veneers. Now, if you've seen any of my other video, you'll know that it's not only the teeth which make a smile, but it's also the gum. So it's important to get the gums nice and symmetrical, but right now, can you see there's a massive kind of bit of recession on one or two of these teeth? So we've got this massive problem. We've got all this gum recession, but what are we gonna do about it? Well, what we did was we actually took a little bit of gum from somewhere else in the mouth and we transplanted it. We put it to fix this, um, this area of recession. And I know whenever I mention this to my patients, they, they, they instantly think, oh my God, what a horrific kind of treatment. But with anything, you know, numbed up really well, it doesn't actually hurt. It looks terrible, okay? There's no way of, doing, of, of getting around this. On the day of treatment, it doesn't look really pretty, but within a week, it starts looking a lot better. And I'm not even gonna show you the photos of what it looks like straight away afterwards. But we do this treatment and then we let the gums heal and check it out. This is what it looked like after doing the treatment. Now, the, the recession has gone, but the gum symmetry is still not perfect. So what we then did was we did the, what we call the small design treatment. We used the, the best quality kind of veneers, but we used a soft tissue laser just to sculpt the, the edges and the shape of the gums. So we did all of this in one go. By the way, this happens six months after doing the gum treatment, the initial gum treatment, because it takes that much time for the gums to really settle. So we went through the whole process of redesigning my patient's smile in her mouth so she can test drive what the final result is gonna look like. And if there's any breakages, we know that we need to adjust the bite in, in those ways. So we went through this whole phase of doing this. She was super happy with the way that it was looking. We then fitted the porcelain veneers and you can see here how, how thin these veneers are. And also we've got color texture and gradients in these colors, to, in, in the veneers to make it look super, really, really natural. So we fitted all these veneers and she was over the moon. So as always, if you're thinking about this kind of treatment and you, you'd like to have a consultation with me, just head over to my website and we can, you can just pop in your details there and we can arrange something. All right, until next time, I'll see you later.